as the spring comes closer and the sun comes out, it's a good time to start thinking about the solar system. What solar panels did people choose in the United States in 2023? How did the market change? My name is Tanya and I am the business manager at A1 Solar Store. Today we'll be looking at the 7 most popular solar brands from the past year and talk a little about the takeaways for the American solar market. Before we start, let me explain how I made this list. I simply picked out 7 solar panels that sold out the best at our store in 2023 and wrote down interesting details about the models or brands. The majority of our customers will look for solar panels for home. So this is what these panels are designed for. With the commercial market, the situation is a bit different. When it comes to projects of a large scope, Installers prefer high output solar panels and bifacial modules. Starting from the bottom, we have QPIC Duo Black Solar Panel from QCells that is rated for 400 watts. QCells is one of the best brands on the solar market, and I was sure that at least one of their panels would make it to the top 7. It's a Korean company with a German engineering team and they make their panels in the United States, Malaysia, Korea and China. This particular panel has a great design and 25-year warranties, which is probably what makes it popular. Not too expensive either. The downside, if you can call it that, is 20% efficiency. It's not bad, but a little below average for the moment. Number 6 is the RSC and Peak 2 solar panel, rated for 360 watts. RSC is a Norwegian company, but the panels are made in Singapore. The name of a panel comes from the N-type cells technology. To put it simply, the power output of a standard solar panel always drops by 2-3% in the first year of operation. When you have a dozen of panels in your system, it's quite a lot of power loss. N-type cells lose less production in the first year. The panel itself is not as modern as, for example, alpha panels from REC, but it is much more affordable. Number 5 is Panasonic Everwald Perk Module. It is rated for 360 watts. Panasonic is a famous brand from Japan. The panels, as far as I know, are also made in Singapore. This is one of the more affordable solar panels from Panasonic, which is probably why it made top 7. The module was discontinued recently, so I don't think we'll see it around much longer. If you want to get your hands on it, you better hurry. It has 25-year warranty for product and performance. It is well designed and it deals with shading well. Number 4 is a panel from JA Solar rated at 395 watts. JA Solar is a Chinese company, one of the largest in the world. The biggest advantage of solar panels from China is the price. This one in particular was going for around $200 or even less. In other ways, it is a fairly standard solar panel with a 12-year warranty. In third place, we have another panel from QCells, QPIC Duo XL. This one is quite different from the others and I'm a little surprised to see it here. The thing is that that it's by facial module. It has an active rear side which absorbs sunlight as well. The front side is rated for 480 watts, but in theory it can produce over 500 watts with the help of the back side. The thing about by facial solar panels is it's a bit hard to install them at home so that you can make good use of their bifacial gain. They are very popular in commercial installations, though. In the second place, we have Trina with its Vertex solar panel, rated for 390 watts. Again, not a surprise. Trina is a Chinese company that fights with JA Solar for first place in manufacturing scope. On one hand, the panels are very cheap, probably the cheapest we have at the moment. On the other hand, the efficiency is quite high. This panel in particular has a 21% conversion rate. You would think they cut corners on quality, but this panel actually has 25-year warranties both for product and performance. Of course, it's not as efficient or as long-lasting as top panels from Panasonic and SunPower, but it's half of their price. And now it's time to reveal and crown the winner. The most popular panel at A1 Solar Store in 2023 
was Black Max from Hyundai. It's rated for 365 watts. I think what happened here is the fact that Hyundai is a big name, a reliable brand that is not going anywhere, and the 25-year warranty for product only confirms it. Unlike it is with Panasonic though, Hyundai solar panels are quite cheap, so it's no surprise that they really flew off the shelves. Congratulations to the winner! Now, what are the takeaways of the past year? What have we noticed about the solar market? The average rated power output of a solar panel grows slowly. A few years ago, the panels between 300 to 350 watts were the most popular. Now they get discontinued and manufacturers make more powerful solar panels around 400 watts and above. The average size of a solar system in the US stays around 6 to 7 kilowatts. If you take 400 watt panels, then that's 15 to 20 modules. The price of a whole solar system is up 3% compared to the beginning of 2023, and that is because the labor went up in price. Panels, on the other hand, are 12% cheaper compared to the year before. So it's a good time for DIY lovers to get some solar. We felt the changes as well, our prices decreased slightly, so I welcome you to A1 Solar Store. If you need solar panels, then the link is in the description below. Let me know in the comments what you think about the state of the market and don't hesitate to ask questions. I'm Tanya and see you next time.